my phone fell and I, and it, it's mirrored, you know, like the screen's mirrored and everything. So I had no way to get a hold of contacts. And then I decided to, you know, am I going to get a new phone or, um, or should I just get that screen fixed? Right. So, um, and also I forgot, I have forgot my password and everything with my password. I had a Mac too. I had a Mac. And everything with my password was anytime I actually, my Mac changed the password or anything, everything went to my phone, went to the phone. And because, you know, how it says retrieve your password or is it by your phone? But I couldn't see the password because my phone smeared, right? So, and then I forgot the password. And, and then it goes, well, it's going to take three to five business days, three to five business days to retrieve all that information. As a, as a, yeah, I work, I work, I work for myself, and but I also, and I just work for myself, but I also work for another company. I, three to five business days with no phone. What do we do? You know, it's like, I can't do that. So I waited the phone situation. And I'm like, you know what? I don't like, I don't like the, the whole making me wait as a business person to, to retrieve my information, to check my identity. Why can't I go to a store, check my identity? Here's my, my passport. Here's my everything. They, they wouldn't buy that. They wouldn't buy that story. So, okay. Well, I was getting a bad negative taste of everything. Right. So negative taste. And then literally I'm not lying to you. I'm, I live in Phoenix and I live by myself out here. I don't have no family. If I was in California, I had no money. And then I go, well, why can't I get my money back from Cash App, right? Maybe I get that back to my card. They said, no, we have to review your identity. It, it basically, it dragged, it dragged, it dragged, it dragged. This is back in the end of February, beginning of March. Look where we're at. We're at the end of April. You know, this is what I'm And I'm still at this point dealing with my money. I have over $100 trying to get my money back from Cash App. But because if I had if I had an if I had a uh, dispute with an, an money that came from my my card, they are able to put that money back to my card. But if I had a dispute with with the Cash App, they can't put that money because it's run by Green Dog. They can't put that money back to the card. They have to um, since I have no Apple device. I decided to sell my Mac. I decided to get rid of the Apple phone. I decided because of the bad taste of everything. I decided not to deal with Apple. I mean, making me wait three to five business days. I need a phone. I'm a business person. Why can't there's no other way that you could refer? You no, know, they kept sending me d d uh, information day by day. Um, d d okay, this is the code you're going to be using. Now, can you please send us a card that you were using, the card you were using? Everything was day by day. Literally, there's no way to to uh, check my identity. Like, there's no other way. So finally, to check my identity and everything else, finally I got everything back. But I told them I have no other device. I have no, I, by this time, I already got rid of my Mac. I already got my phone. I have no device with Apple. I have no connection with Apple. Well, since you have no device and no connection, we want you to go to the store to check your identity. I got sent to two stores, and the stores didn't know what I was talking about. They did not know what I was talking about. Well, then you have a Mac. Then you can check your your air, your wallet there. No, they don't communicate. The, the phone wallet does not communicate with the Mac. And that's something that they, they some of them, management and everything, they found that out. Some of them didn't even know what they were doing, what they were talking about. I was with them. One time I took three or four hours in one day. And I still didn't get nothing resolved. Nothing resolved. So I go, this is my money. It's not your money. It's my money. Well, I moved. I live in, I live in hotel hotels. And then, and then I moved. Well, your ID doesn't show that address that you wanted to send you the check. Well, we can't send you your money. Oh, so you can't send me my check. You can't put it back on the card because um, whatever you, you you can't do it. Um, but then you could send my money back in the card. But I had this because I just put a few items that on the card because if I didn't have access to my Apple, why are you charging me my monthly fees on these other apps? So it made sense. So they just put it. So whatever came from the Apple Cash went back to Apple Cash. Whatever came from my my card went back to my card. So. So they say, well, we, well, why can't you just put it back in my card? Well, we can't do that because it didn't come from that card. And now you want to check my identity? I go, I can't even my ID, but your ID doesn't match your new address. I go, and they go, well, do you have a new? I go, no, I don't have a new ID. Do you have a medical bill? No, I don't have a medical bill. I go, do you want me to get in an accident, have a medical bill? Um, do you have a, a government? I, I have no other form of ID, but I do have my passport. I have my, my passport. I have my, my passport ID. I have my ID. No, we can't check your ID. And finally, I did go to, I did finally receive a doctor bill. Oh no, now we need two forms of ID.
they say we can't send you money. So the whole the whole thing with the your ID is a mess. So I did get the the the, the uh, medical bill that I had, and it said. But when they told me it was one, you need one of these bills. No, now we need we need two of the bills. I go. You just said you needed one. I go. Well, what happens if I live in a hotel? If I'm homeless, right? If I don't have an address, if I'm homeless, and if I live in a hotel, you know, here and there, and that's what I do. So what? Why, why, why can't I get my money? I have. I'm giving you. I go to. I went to the store. Didn't know what I was talking about. Why can't the store? You know, check my identity. You know, why can't Apple Store check my identity? Why can't if they? They're so. It's so easy for them to give me my money back for for and, and it's a student put it back in my card because it came from back from my, for my card, but because it came from Apple Cash, money that the money that I deposit or money that was deposited for me from, you know, for my friends or, my, or anything from Apple Cash, why can't I get that money? They have stressed me out a lot. It's been two, over two months and this stressed me out. You know, I can't believe what else do you want me to check? I mean, what else do you want me to do? Like, you know, what else can I check my identity? You know, if I don't have an address and but that's, that's my money. It's my money. It's not nobody else's money. And that's why I told them, well, your identity. And I'm like, well, you already verified me. What else do you need to verify me? Apple have verified me. What else do you need from me? And this is where we're at. Well, we can't give you, we can't send you your check. Literally, I spoke to him. I go, you know what? Thank you. You don't have to send me my check. There's nothing else I can do. And I'm done with you guys. And and what else do I do? Where, where I'm stuck. It's my money. It's not their money. And I gave him the medical. I gave him my, the medical where I was at the hospital before, you know, a while back. And I gave him with the address I had that where I get my mail. And I used my friend's address. And literally, I had that. It was. It wasn't enough. We need two documents now. Two documents. It wasn't that address that it goes to me, and that's a medical bill. You know, but my 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 passport. My passport ID didn't count. My regular ID doesn't count just because I don't have an address for that. I don't have a specific address. Well, people do live in a hotel, right? People live in a hotel. People work and jump around in different places. Well, what about that? I mean, like, what do, what do they do? You know? I mean, the government verifies me right away, you know? My other banks verify me right away, but this is Apple and Green Dot. I don't know what the situation is. Why can't they give me my money? It's not their money. What happens if I don't have an address? What happens if I am homeless? What happens if I am homeless? What, what happens then? But I do have my ID, I have a driver's license, and I have a passport, but I don't have an address. If I live in my car, how do you, you I, what else then? And, but they, they don't even tell me to go to the store. Go to the store and verify, they don't verify you. What, what happens then? They have dragged me. I have I have lost work. I have lost hours of pay. I have lost stress. I, you know, and, and, and literally, literally, I've cried to my mom. My mom is in California. And literally, I was, what else do I do? And that's why I reached out to you guys, you know? And literally, I, I, I saw all my devices. I had, and also, I had a business account with them. I got, I took, I got rid of that. I, 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 the only thing I have left from devices is the, the mouse and the box. But I got rid of the laptop. I got rid of the iPad. I got rid of the phone. Because I have nothing to do with Apple. Nothing to do with Apple. Oh. <laughs> Apple could do now. I don't think there's anything really to do now. I just, I mean, I want my money. The stress, the time I, I lost, the 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 the, the crying, the, the the aggregation, the argumental, the 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 stress. Like I just spoke to like thirty or forty different people, and nobody was able to help me. And I literally, what is there to do? I mean, you can't. Whatever happened, you can't bring it. You know, you can't. You, you, it's 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 like share back. You can't bring back time. You know, you can't bring back time. I mean, I mean, I, I think we're gonna have to go to court after this. I mean, after this situation, we're gonna have to go to court because that's the only other way. You know. And now I have to file for stress, for losing time, for, you know, for any, any, everything. Like, literally, I'm not, like, I, I don't know what to say. Because I don't, I don't know what to do, what to say. I mean, if, if, if I finish everything else, the next thing is just to go to court.